Hello, welcome back. Um, this is going to be a very short video, sort of to make up for the really long one that I posted earlier today. And um, we're to the point where we're just going to paint. So I've, I've uh, primed this. I used AK Extreme this stuff. AK Primer and Micro Filler. And uh, it's, it's really great. I love the finish. It's super, super, super smooth. It goes down super smooth. And it's very, very even. Not blotchy. It's, it's really, it's really nice. Okay. Well, I am going to paint. After I paint, there's nothing to do. <clears throat> You've got to let the paint cure. And then it's and then it's basically assembly. I got the wheels, you know, tires, whatever. All wheels and tires all uh, painted up on a stick. I gotta do the centers in green, same color as the Hilo. Uh, I've got all of these, you know, rocket pods and and Ray Dome and everything else that's there, um, uh, they're all they're all the same color. So I will. Oh, oh, and I'm going to use U.S. Army Hilo Drab from AK Real Colors. Um, okay, sorry about that. Um, Anyway, uh, I'm going to use this AK Real Colors, this uh, U.S. Army Hilo Drab. Um, I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to do it through my Harder and Steenbeck Evolution. Um, it's uh, it's a really nice, really nice airbrush. Um, I had to work extra hours to make enough money for this. So anyway, uh, and I do have some parts that are still on this on the um, sprues. Like this one right here isn't going to get anything else except silver or steel color in the middle for the for the rotor uh, pieces. Um, but I've got all the the rockets missiles over here. I've got I think it's a pitot tube, and then there's a um, thing to hold the uh, side of the cockpit door or window open. Um, well, I guess it's a door too. Um, the um, blades, um, they'll get, uh, right now it's just black primer. Oops, sorry. Right now it's just black primer for the, for the rotor blades and everything, but um, they'll get painted black. And then uh, the uh, rotor head bits will be steel or aluminum or uh, whatever color you want to call that. Um, so I am going to um, I'm going to go ahead and do this. So um, I think what I'll do is I will. Um, I'm not going to make you guys try to watch me, you know, for, for 45 minutes, whatever, half an hour, um, just painting. That's pretty boring, <laughs> pretty boring stuff. Um, that's why you didn't, you didn't see me prime it. Um, I'll tell you what, I'll do part of the front of this helicopter, and then I'm going to turn it off and um, <clears throat> the next video should be the final video and it'll be um, it'll be me assembling all of these bits um, so okay let's get to it we need 
from Mr. Color Leveling Thinner. Okay, I'm also going to put my respirator on after I do this little bit here because uh, it gets stinky <laughs> and I don't want to be breathing it in. Try to just do some light coats. So anyway, you can see it's starting to starting to take shape there, starting to look green like it's supposed to. sure you get all the nooks and crannies. All right, I'm gonna put my respirator on. <laughs> so, I will pause this and come back and show you what it looks like at the end, and then we'll go from there. Okay, we're back. I took off my respirator, we're done. Um, here is the helicopter. Looking really, really good and looks nice and smooth and good coverage of the color. Um, and then we have all the bits like the machine gun that goes in the front and the uh, radar, radome, and uh, another, another missile and the thing that holds the gun and wheels and the part of the front that is a um, for the FLIR and the uh, uh, laser systems for the for, to, for guidance and for, for bombs and stuff. Anyway, um, so yeah, so I'm not going to put this together tonight because the paint needs to cure overnight. It once it cures, it'll be rock hard and. And won't be a problem. We'll just we'll start gluing stuff together, you know. So, um, so yeah. So that's it. And uh, I'll see you guys. Uh, I guess tomorrow. <laughs>